your brain is literally wired to keep you stuck. But guess what? You can rewire it. Let me show you how. When you repeat a behavior, whether it's self-harm, avoidance, or numbing out, your brain strengthens those neural pathways. Kind of like a well-worn trail in the woods. The more you walk on it, the easier it is to follow. But here's the good news. You can build new pathways using healthier coping skills. The more you practice them, the stronger they become. So here's some ideas on things you can do to help rewire your brain. You got mindfulness and grounding techniques, things that keep you centered and in the present moment. These slow down the stress response and teaches your brain to pause before reacting. And there's tapping, which helps regulate emotions by calming the nervous system. Movement helps release endorphins and helps strengthen emotional resilience. And then cold exposure, like splashing water on your face, helps activate the vagus nervous system, helping to shift you out of distress. Journaling and self-talk interrupts negative thought loops and rewires them with new patterns. The key is repetition. First, it feels unnatural, but every time you choose a healthy coping skill, you're reinforcing a new and stronger pathway in your brain.